Hello there. Lolly in the words of the big man in green. Let's finish the fight. Damn. We are... I don't think we're gonna finish today. Part of the reason uh, being, I think there's more than I think to the game. Um, I could be wrong. Oh, no, don't open Street Fighter. No, 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 wait a minute. <laughs> no, of course I have it. Is that the last stream of Persona 5? No. I think Monday will be, though. I think. Surprise, Street Fighter stream. No, no. No, 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 it's not. Force of habit. I am in gold now, though, fun fact. Get me out of here. Huggy Woggies. Conga rats. Conga rats? Um. Who wants to see her waifu? I do. I guess it depends on how long you spend mementos. Yeah, but I, I, today's like not gonna be a full stream. Um, part of the reason is because I'm busy and I have some life shit to do. Uh, and the other part of the reason is I don't feel very well. Because if you guys have been keeping up with me, and by that I mean you just happened to see the tweet I made yesterday. Um, I had the worst goddamn migraine of my entire life yesterday. <laughs> um, I thought I was gonna die. And that's only half a joke. Um, I couldn't see at one point, so that was cool. Um, so naturally, I spent most of the day resting. And I feel a lot better today, but I'm still a little tired. Yeah, my, my goal this stream is to try to get through Mementos to our last Mementos run. And maybe do the remaining days that we have, of which we've got like four. And then bring us right up to the palace. You also hear voices tell you you have the power to change the world? How did you know? I can eliminate suffering. I can eliminate suffering. It can be me. I can be the one to do it. I, I can stop it. I can make the world a better place. I'm gonna go in here because I like that I like the ambient music here better. Because <laughs> we have to do a tarot reading. Look at that. Honestly, I don't think my persona would give me the power to change the world. Um, I think my persona would give me the power to just really hurt the people that have wronged me. I feel like I have a very spicy person. I feel like it'd be a very vicious thing. Um, yeah, my goal is to like first to kind of do all of our catch up work, because um, I don't want to start like the palace and only get like a quarter of like I don't want to start the boss, you know, the final boss fight and only get like a quarter of the way through it. You know what I mean? Like Shido's boss fight took like. All of that in total took like two hours. Y'all the blue took like three, right? So like, again, I don't want to be in a situation that's going to be like all funky. Let you go to sleep on command. Your persona is the Sandman. Didn't feel like two hours. I, it was close to like two hours. So, like, I want to get all of our stuff done. I want to get all of our stuff done 
and then, like, Monday, immediately start. Right? Like, that, that's kind of my goal. Uh, Barbie tomorrow, Sammy? No, 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 no. I'm going to Oppenheimer tomorrow. Uh, real talk, though, I actually do want to see Oppenheimer. <laughs> That's not even a joke. Tomato, tomato. Same thing, right? You're not gonna do the double feature like me? Yeah, but I... I work tomorrow. No matter, I don't have time for a double feature. I have to go talk- I have to go kill a nightmare god, too. It's only- I've only been in a seven hour fight. I started watching your stream with P5, so feels appropriate my prime sub comes up near its end less than three. Hell yeah, Dragon Pup. That's great. That is cool. And that makes sense. You've been here for about seven months? Because this playthrough has taken about seven months. Hot damn. Uh, thank you so much, Pup. I super duper appreciate it. I hope you have an absolutely beautiful day. This is my beautiful. Love you so, so much. Okay. Um. And Asmira, thank you so much for 24 months. Sorry, I missed that. Uh, that's two years! Holy shit! Hell yeah. That's so many years. Did you hear that 12 plus 12 equals 24 times months of years have you been subscribed? That's bloggers. It's crazy. Oh my god. It's like all my nine days have come at once. Oh, hey, look what time it is. Sal, thanks for the 34 months. Did you know that 20 plus 14 equals 34? Which time I went to subscribe for this kind of water. Thank you, guys. All right. So I am going to do the tarot draws for Persona 4 when I start playing Persona 4. Um, But this is our probably our second to last Persona 5 one. So we'll start it out with our past being... How appropriate. The fool. Yeah, because we're the fool. And that's our past. That's cute. I like that. Day before the present is the world. Or the future. Yeah. Y'all know what the fool is. It's recklessness. It's adventurousness. Naivety. Foolishness. That's all in the past, as we were the fool once, but now we are Zawardo. Um, that's a, that is appropriate. Um, but yeah, no, I mean we we have start we started our journey a long time ago, and now we are seeing the end of it, or beginning to. As for our present, we have. The Eight of Cups. Well, Cups. Less exciting. Interaction, gathering, and connection. Look at that. Um, basically about like interacting, connecting. Working together that face with minor arcana. They were supposed to drain the cups. Ah, you got me. But yeah, so we're supposed to work together, gather, and do our best. We're gonna use some teamwork. Maybe that's you consolidating all your compound strength 10. Probably. These in case you guys missed it. I am a hot, sexy, bad bitch, and I've maxed out every single goddamn confident. Before the end of the game. On my first playthrough, without a guide. Just saying. Bow down. Bad bitch energy. I am so cool and sexy. Holy shit. So, I'm so proud of this, though. I, I'm so proud of this. What about the secret bonus confidant?
friends will now die for you. That's <laughs> your photo scalping, of course. The dick fuck arcana. Oh, no! What about the world? Uh, there isn't a world. I think. Lavenza! Right, we can't forgore Lavenza. We will not forgore Lavenza. But I'm probably gonna do that tonight, actually. Might, uh, end that with tonight. End tonight with that. I love Lavenza. The true comments were the friends we made along the way. True! Anyway, Eight of Cups is togetherness and teamwork. It's working together. And our future is... The Ten of Coins. Look at that. Abundant success. A large amount. A large amount of these nuts! But, uh, a large amount of success. Look at that. Probably because, yeah, we're going to succeed. It's the ten, it's the ten of coins. No, not these nuts. Yeah, we're gonna make it big time. Oh, you bet. Ten of coins represents achievement to unlock. So now it's time to pay yourself and enjoy the rewards. We're gonna have an enjoyable time. Maybe. Depends on how sad the game makes me. I am worried. The Fool, the Eight of Cups, the Ten of Coins. That's what we got. That's what we have. Our second to last tarot draw for Persona 5. Second to last. That's what we got, baby. They could they could put his name down. Why why gotta be skilled gamer? Why can't it just be Shinya? Like why why are they doing him like that? So why do they call him a fine young man? The official title. I guess that that's true because Yoshida's man of the people. And Sai is prosecutor. And Bad Heli Doctor. Takemi. And Lavenza. I know, I do love that when you bring Lavenza up, the butterfly goes across the screen. You got like fortune teller. Everyone else has their real ass names though. To the velvet room. Where are your personas? Releasing your persona? It seems to have gained a fair amount of power. Which persona will you confine? May luck be on your side. Indeed. May luck be on your side. Whenever for <laughs> When I was 14, whenever Shinya shows up. Ah, really? 
So sorry. Any idea how many stamps you have? Uh, a large number? Why? Should I collect more stamps? Oh god, Christ, don't remind me about Sumi. Well then. Ugh. Not even the like. The showtime thing, I'm sure, is gonna be cringe. Um. I'm sure it's gonna be cringe. Hello, Durant. Check how many stamps I've done. miso soup. That sounds really good. I'd love to try some of your soup one day. The use case show. God damn. Starving. Allow me. <laughs> oh, Some yeah. sauce. A touch of red. Bon appetit. Oh, man. It's just what I want. Uh, uh, get out of my face. I know if Lilith showed up my, at my door, I would not shoot her. <laughs> not bad. I'm just gonna just run in this show. Sure, we're hungry. Persona. This doesn't look good. Be careful. We are the better fighters. Use fire. Yeah. Keep that up. Oh, that's it. Let's that 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 got knocked down. Come on, stay together. Fox's like oh, health is really low. You have to be careful. Persona. Bro, stop killing you, Skate. How will you signify? Yeah. <laughs> good work, everyone. But if she showed up at your door in the middle of a delicious beef bowl, I would still just be like, Lilith, give me a chance, please. Please, anything for you. That's probably what I do. Uh, King, thank you so much for the folly. So we appreciate it. Hope you have an absolutely uh, beautiful day. A regal day. You mean my day more regal? I love you so much. Yeah, this is this is the extra semester, so if you don't want those spoilers, watch out, Dennis. Oh, oh. When we're riding in the car like this, it's 
easy to forget that we're actually inside Mona. Right? Mona's pretty mind-blowing. You better thank him properly. Somewhere. Uh, Akachi, why did you have to point that out, bud? Try to start combos. True, true. Okay, so I've got 20 out of 40 stamps for this level. So what, I just keep running up and down it? Trying to find them, I guess. There's a treasure chest. Messy with you. Come, probably. Let's open it. Hi, Penny. What's up? Oz is pretty good. How are you? I'm having a good time. About to finish Persona. I have not seen you guys. Oh my god. Hello. It should be easy. Let's go. This enemy is the Persona! It should be easy. Yeah. Someone finish it! Yeah. Persona! <laughs> Ice attacks are out. They're weak, but don't let your guard down. this? <laughs> no psychokinesis! Attack with something else! Mm. Persona! Or his crazy laugh. I love his crazy laugh. Take that! That's one down! His evil rival right laugh. Roger. On to the next! I am thou. Die! You got him, Fox! One enemy oh, hit the ground! The seats are a dark pink color. Either. Let's end them. It's time to end this. God, Yusuke came off the bench with an with a vendetta. I took him off. I like I put him on the bench so I could play with Akechi a bit, and I took him off. And Yusuke's like, I will prove myself. Enchanted. No time to waste. Good work, They everyone. do have a good show time. I like theirs. Okay. Let's hurry ahead. Focus. God. Make me a bench warmer, will you? I will okay, prove we'll myself. We should beat them instead of running. Special attack, full heal. Thank you. Thank you. Arsa, don't be a coward. Let me at him. She really did.
Yeah, you know what? Luke, you know what? Actually. About five minutes a month to watch Twitch. My life will be is very busy. Alright, I'm sorry, panic. It was good to see you though. Let's go. I recommend attacking any enemy who has a status ailment. Die! Someone finish it! Sona! No. no psychokinesis! Attack Come. with something else! Morning star is so good. Okay. Good job. Hmm. Let's keep going. Then perish. Excellent. There's the platform. We've made it through the area. Why is hunting for stamps so hard? I haven't found a single stamp. I should just give up. Oh, Futaba got maxed. I leveled up. It was already hard for me to believe palaces existed, but to think there's such a massive one under Shibuya. It's not all that different from the real world. The Tokyo subway system is bonkers. Joker, there's a chest! Oh, Sumi. I'm still mad. I haven't let that go. Get a whole... A whole thing. Alright, going up. I know it's not very healthy, but I do enjoy eating ramen from time to time. That's where instant ramen shines. No waiting in line to order, and it couldn't be easier to make. No, Taba! <laughs> no! Also... God, Makoto, you are such a closeted nerd. Like, li oh, there's Jose. Like, literally just like, I know it's kind of unhealthy, but I actually like ramen sometimes. <laughs> like, oh my God. She, her character arc is about her coming out of the nerd closet. Absolutely. Oh my God. The top is like, well, that's why you eat instant ramen. It's great. <laughs> Makoto's like, the sisters-in-law talk. Oh, Mister, doing good. Good job. I'm looking forward to seeing you. You guys have my stamps again each time we cross paths. Same with Whoa. flowers. Oh, I got a whole bunch of them out. I think I might have passed the halfway mark. Keep up the good work. God, how many stamps have I collected? I have no idea where my stamp number's at. I mean, I'm assuming, like, quite a lot, right? Because I'm, like, I'm pretty far up here. I got no clue, though. You get to eat during the week so delicious. Hey, look. Damn. 
that's 21 out of 40. How many stars do you have in each thing? Shit, I, I don't know. Like, I can go back and check. They're, mo they're almost maxed out, though. Should we do next? Here I'll go. Wouldn't a grappling hook be awfully handy in the real world? Stop. I've heard that one so much. Also, I'm really about to accidentally max out all the thieves, aren't I? Hi. Alright. So yeah, I I'm eight stars in each category. Do I have to max them or something? It would be cool grappling hook. Ah! Sup, bones? How you boning around? Exactly enough stamps to max everything. Do I have to? We have matching tails. Sorry to interrupt your bonding session, but if you're talking about tails, I'll point out that I have one too. Furry time. You don't have to max everything. You're trying to collect all the stamps? No, not really. Somebody's just like, oh, you should get like a certain number of stamps. Then you can like see something cool, like, huh? This is what I saw. Stay all the way over there. But, like, Joker. Oh, yo, bones. That's great. I'm sure you'll get the job. I'm sure you're gonna land it, and if not, let me know, and I'll eat them. I'll devour them whole. I'm sure, I'm sure you'll get it. You're like super qualified. Phantom Thief Workout. Well, that's certainly a unique approach. It's somewhere. We made it to the oh, Okay, according to your calculations. Okay, so that means I'm actually like really close. So you should have just hit one. That was just 123. Oh, because, yeah, that would have been... Yeah, you're right, actually. But I pretty much just did it. Joker, there's a chest! That would have been five, and I think I have five. Yeah, I've got, like, five left over. Look at that. Oh, wow, I'm so good at this. I'm like so gamer, it's not even fun. And there's another stamp. I'm even more gamer. And Jose even showed up on this level too, so. I wonder if it's got something to do with Jose and learning what his fucking deal is. We got to the platform. We can head up from here. I have a few different superstitions for good luck in my routines. They get sort of hard to drop. I've heard that kind of stuff turns into an everyday routine for athletes eventually. Sammy didn't even have to try. I'm just so good. Oh, mister. 
Hey, Jose. Doing good? Got it. I've been looking forward to seeing you. It seems you've catching each other across the past, same with flowers. Whoa. Wow, you've got a whole bunch of them now. I think you might have passed the halfway mark. Keep up the good work. Assuming it's something to do with Jose, it doesn't have to be. Jose is just a little La Critera. Silly little guy. He certainly is a silly little guy. specialize in Japanese style painting, but I'd like to learn some Western techniques as well. Whether Japanese or Western, it doesn't change the fact that they're both valid approaches to art. All right, somebody, there was some malice. What, what member of the writing team was like, had a bone to pick with that one? That seems Is targeted. That one? Don't let it get away. Indiana Jones? That was a weird line, exactly. That's why I'm like, who? Who got in, like an argument with somebody about this? Stay focused. Persona. Don't hurt your dialogue right here. Surprisingly tough. It was too specific. This is a part of me. Go. Wink wink shot to the West anime watchers. There. Oh, had some rare loot. Well, on to the next oh, trial. Okay, let's move on. Okay. They didn't stand a chance. Bored now. Go find a strong enemy. Ugh. Western anime watchers are the worst. Yeah, yeah. Who, who would do that? Imagine watching. Anime. Yeah, who, who watches anime? Who? Uh, wow. Who would do that? Probably just stupid. Weaves, but it's like 80% of right. that's the joke. <laughs> that's like pretty much everyone here. I'll just add this. Who that? 80% sounds conservative. It's like probably 98% of everyone here. I'll send you the results. We are playing Somewhere. Persona right now. Oh, this is a big loop. Persona to be an anime, so y'all are on no yeah that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Then I'll send you the results. Yeah, exactly right. Like it's a JRPG technically, but it literally has anime cutscenes and has an anime. Mm -hmm. Then. Old 
good guy. If I watch a weeb stream, does that make me a weeb? True. At least if I turn into like an anime girl. If I get a VTuber ring and turn into anime girl. Yeah. Bam. Linear is kind of linear. Okay. All I need is linear. Come on. I'm a 40 year old man. Oh man, don't you know that's not right? You know that's not right, what? don't you? Of course it's right. Spending money on her makes me happy. I'll do anything for her. Linear smiles what I live for. No! No conditional. Listen, watch out, Joker. You're gonna turn into a horse. Hunts. No oh, but I can play about my hubby's my wife, and that's more than enough. Just go away already. Persona. Gotcha now. <laughs> this is my other self. So sweeping. A horse is a horse, of course, of course. Okay. Yes, that's useless. Persona! Get fucked. Persona. Not this. Your opponent is strong. Don't do anything reckless. Well, now. Oh. I'm gone. This is going to be one less otaku cheering on for Lily Dion. Just let me go out. for Lily Dion. Has this ever happened? The hell? I, have we ever had somebody big like this? Get idols are important. That's not everything in life, right? You need to tell them that they're more, more important things in life. Here's the stuff we know about him. He's got no place at home. He wants to get involved in his kid's life, but he can't. Oh, this is fun! It's a royal mechanic I think they used exactly twice. Huh. This is cool. I actually like this. Way better than just beating them into submission. Alright. Miss Lydia, do you understand me right? My love for her. You got your family. Who do you think you are? Oh, you gotta bring up my Honestly. family for family, huh? All I've done with my wife is argue. Not. Of course the kid to learn a shit ton of stuff I told her it's too much. She doesn't understand that. My words don't reach her heart. But not Lily Dion. Lily Dion always always pays attention to what I have to say. She's the only one that listens to me. Fuck you, kid. Can't do anything now. My money goes to her CDs. It doesn't even have time to go to the conference. I haven't even thought of my family. What a pity. Life is the one that stopped caring about me, so I decided to stop caring about her. I see. And that's what's got you into idols. I think he stopped caring about his family, but we all know that's not the case. Joker! Tell him, Joker. The family doesn't need me. A healthy parasocial relationships. I leveled up. Also, a Koto's ranked at level 99 now. Too. My wife were always arguing about how to raise her kid. That's what I found in Lydion. Lydion was always working hard and smiling. I felt like I was chasing that dream with her. Using Lillian to escape my stressful home life because she allowed me to dream again. Having a student point that will hand out to me drove me nuts. I'm so pathetic. And again. Now you know what you gotta do, right? I really messed up. Indeed. As long as I be with my family first, then I can chase after Lily Dion. Uh, yeah, I hope she gets both. Hell yeah. Come on. I'm not gonna stop chasing her? I guess it's not a bad thing to have a hobby. If you become a dad, you can be proud of. Thank you. For everything. Late, I will. Spoiler, Fuwa. She's happy and smiling because that's her job. 
One shot kill card. Nice. An idol and a unicorn. Because he turned into a unit. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, I like that method too. I like the method of like talking them out of it. That seems like a good idea. They should have done that more. Also, all of these royal mementos targets have been very interesting. I have something. Because it's literally, it's literally been like so many of them are just like different than all the others. Like that one, that guy didn't even stop going after like his little idol. We didn't even get him to back down off of that. He was literally just like, um... Yeah, it, it was literally just like, uh... Him, like, compromising over it so that he can take better care of his family. I get stiff all over from just sitting in the car. Well, there's an athlete for you. I have Wanna something. try exploring for a while on foot? God, we're kind of brutal. Uh. I'm just gonna max all these guys out without even trying. Jeez. The platform. Yeah, like no, it's just kind of like it, it's interesting how we don't persuade him out of it. Shadows detected, and they're real strong. Proceed with caution, Joe. Kind of like the uh, the kid who's like, Focus. I'm a danger to my sister. It's like, well, you still gotta like care for your sister, and he's like, yeah, but I hate her too. Like, ugh. It's like we've gotten like so far into mementos. There's like targets you can like, you can't turn them all the way around. You can only turn them like partially. Around. Shadow. Which is like what? Joker, there's a treasure chest. Panther, we have matching tails. Mine's fake though. But it's cute, so I don't mind. Okay, so that's like a different oh, line of dialogue. A treasure chest. Instead of Yusuke interjecting, be like, I have a tail too. On can say something too. Oh, that's fun. Vanilla then just is kind of black and white and nasty gamers. Coil tries to be a bit more nuanced. I like that. It's good. It shows that like some things are a bit like they're less cut and dry, you know. Oh, excellent. It's a treasure chest. you everything you need to know about being a phantom thief. Relax, you're in good hands. I appreciate it. Please correct me if I make a mistake. I like that wasn't at you, Yusuke. Okay, there's the platform. Nice find. Yeah. I think every dialogue has three different versions. contrast to Dr. Brainwash. It is a good contrast to to our gentle madman. It's, it's more about us trying to like help people and and give them uh like give them what they need rather than just changing them completely. They spotted us. Let's finish them quickly. really low level or some shit? <laughs> Sorry, Ko. Why are they so tough? Persona. <laughs> Let's 
Let's go. Persona! Die! From two to one! Keep that up, Fox! Let's go. Not this. So my sure. I forgot I gave her the thing that makes everything cheaper. Ready for orders. Uh, like what? I 
I am thou. Like you're ready to rule. You bet. Now. Time to get a little crazy. Stay yeah, focused. Sorry. Showtime. And now three Maras. No! I don't want to fight the Maras. I don't want to fight the dick demon. Oh, look, there was one right there. Somewhere. I leveled up. Hey, look. We're max level. Fix yourself, Sammy. Now's our chance. This enemy is the new guy. Persona! It should be easy if you stay focused. Out of our way! Finish it for me! Let's go. They are they are reusing enemies here. All Interesting. Right. A decisive Focus. victory. It is kind of funny to see like just the biggest dicked version of like Jack Frost and Jack O' Lantern. Like, hey, I remember when I fought mm -hmm. you guys in the first palace, then and then they come back and they're like, blazing hell, diamond dust. And I'm like, ah. It's the evil streamer! Anosaki, let's stop it for his brother's sake. Maruki granted their wishes to be stronger. <laughs> ah, dance, dance. See, this is getting so upset. My videos is incredible. The hell? Dear Amasaki, you really don't give a damn about how much trouble you're causing your family. What? Trouble for my family? You want to understand haters are my motivation. The guy's addicted to hating. Are you dumb or something? Parents and brothers are idiots. They're just cowards who don't understand my fame. Come at me, bro. Gonna get even more famous. Nastiest target in the deepest pits of Mementos. A streamer. The final Mementos target. The most evil one of them all. Gamer. You <laughs> Seth Rogen left? <laughs> I mean, he, he's literally like a rage bait guy. He's like, to show me my popularity. Huh? What? He's calling for backup. I'll use my persona! Or Gore. Yeah, he's my opponent is strong. Don't do anything <laughs> reckless. Persona. There. It's a Twitch streamer, boss. It is. Persona! 
Gore. Oh, it's it's very cool. I like it too. Sibley. Asterius. Go down. Damn it. Helper, you missed. He has a vain blast. All right. The opponent is strong. You're not gonna evade this shit. Good job, Taba. It's time. This fight is going to be good. Persona! Haru the Goat! Had a mob buffalo. I just had a buffalo. That's okay. For gore. I am thou. I could just target him. Oh, what I should. This is my other self. Persona. Take this. Come. Ah, crap. What was I doing? Ah, oh, crap. What was that doing? Gotcha now! <laughs> Lock it, you bitch. What did he say? Don't do anything reckless. Put on your clown shoes? Thank you. Good job, Kodo. Persona. The opponent is strong. Persona. Don't do anything reckless. 
This is my other self. Man, I'm so glad my whole strategy was just making these guys for gore over and over. Because they are tough as shit. We can beat this. Persona! Ravage them! Persona! The opponent is strong. Don't do anything reckless. Yeah, like hella help. Yeah, I'm glad I like it was kind of a joke to make them for gore repeatedly, but I'm really glad I kept doing that. Holy I hell. Have a choice. See, my view count just get higher and higher. It just felt so good. I got so bad at my family for taking that enjoyment away from me. I'm sorry. That's crazy. I was thinking the haters were my motivation. Punched my brother and said such horrible things to my I'm parents. sorry. I was such an idiot. Let that be a lesson. Don't become a streamer, everyone. Don't do it. It's a bad idea. You'll punch your brother and yell at your parents. Hmm. Just saying. Back to life. Hmm. Sammy knows this because it happened to her, too. I don't have any brothers. But you're right. It did. It'll happen to you. I have yelled at my parents. Uh, it had nothing to do with streaming, but I have yelled at my parents. Focus. But I also do not have a brother to touch. There's the platform. That's a high punchy bag. But yes, I know. You don't have brothers anymore. Dun dun. Done. Uh, you know what? I'm so sorry. We were having a good time. We were saying some silly little jokes. We were having a good time. I think I'm gonna pop something here. I don't like this. Hey buddy, what are we doing here? Hey buddy, what's up? Why are you here? Oh, hey guys, good job. Oh, the goofy music's playing, we're okay. Hmm? Jose-chan, you seem kinda down. Is something wrong? Sorry, I didn't mean to make you worry. But a lot's happened lately. Feel that, buddy. Okay, so we're we're fine, right? Before I got here, I was able to drink so many flowers. You know, you know, juicy. That was all thanks to you guys. So I thought I was beginning to understand humans, but now the more flowers I drink, the less I understand them instead. Gotcha. It's like love, right? What? You know, puppy love. What? You understand his explanation. Sco. <laughs> you guys like, what? You know squat about love. Yo! Oh, boy! Is that at Yusuke? Or is that at, is that at Ryuji? Shut up! I know what I'm talking about. Pretty That's much. That's how Ryuji roasted. Boneface is right. I've learned about humans in a manner similar to falling in love. Tom, you don't have to murder the man. When you learn more about a subject, it's often more than unexpected. It's the exact opposite of what you liked about it. Hey, Jose, are you going to start going, maybe humanity is so flawed it must be wiped from existence yeah you could just not just like with love that's it 
Right? <laughs> See? I want to learn more about humans. He hasn't been picking up her hints. True, true. But I wonder if I'll learn what I need to about them just by keeping at it like this. Mind if I propose a simple solution? Don't listen to it, Catchy. Why study humans at all? Why not just give it up? I was literally about to say, he's gonna say give up. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> just give up. I can't do that. I promised someone that I'd study humans. Who? Who'd you promise? Uh, sorry. Forget I said that. What's going on? <laughs> I can see how that would worry you. There are times where the truth seems to move further away from you the more you strive to reach it. Good I advice. dealt with similar problems, so I can totally relate. to handle them whenever the opportunity presents itself though I really appreciate your help with this so I need an opportunity oh that's it could I ask you guys a favor I'd like you to fight me what Yeah, I think you left out a step or three. I'm not following here. Okay. I've learned something from studying humans. The language of violence. When humans suffer, they vent their emotions so they can move forward with their lives. I don't want to fight the baby. Well, right now, I'm suffering. Oh? The only people I can vent at are you guys. And the most common way to vent is to fight. I've studied humans and learned the language of violence. You want to get physical here? You can't just pick a fight with us out of nowhere. I catch he's like, yes! What do we do? I definitely didn't expect this. Well, unless we fight him, we won't know whether or not this is his opportunity. Or fight We simply have to decide if we're going to humor him. Akechi's like, oh, I guess we'll just simply have to decide. Gee, he's getting what horny again. Should we fight, Jose? Let's fight. Thanks. This may be sudden, but here I come. Why is it plain? I'm going to start venting now. Uh, okay. Don't expect me to hold back. Pedal to the metal. Uh. Off the enemy's attack. Wait, guys. Ayo, I think I yeah. think this is bad. <laughs> He's going to Let's isekai go. us. Fighting this child, we don't have a choice. You're mine. Ow! That hurts more than I thought it would. But that's not all your feelings yet, is it? We're just getting started. Try to keep up with me. 
Persona. Dude, all of the fucking velvet cognitive dissonance are the most interesting fuckers. He resists physical. Persona. Why does the music go hard? Because it's like the best soundtrack. The opponent is strong. Don't do anything Persona. Feel my rage. Not bad. Persona. Shall we? Not right. Fox is drawing on Persona. That should do. Persona. How's this? They couldn't turn into a robot. It's true. Huh? Bring a terrible boy out for this. He'll enjoy it. He'll have a good time. Not bad. Huh? I'm starting to enjoy this. Jose? Why though? This hurts so much, but I'm actually enjoying it. Jose craves violence! Wait, I need to focus. Here I come, folks! Persona! Arsene! Ravage them! I'll break them. Gun damage, though, do ya? I should have healed. I really understand how you feel now. Thank you. Now it's time to show you how I feel. No. This is what I've learned from studying humans. Witness my true feelings. How's this? This is not bad. Doesn't right? have much help left. This one's special. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. Um, not that. Thor's help. She needs help. Make this quick. Are you Sammy? I'm, I'm, I'm. Persona. I'm, I'm doing. Here. See if I can life wall this. No holding back. Not bad, doesn't have much help left. 
Makoto dodged it. Hot damn. And full heal. Nice time. My girl is superstar. Makrito. That should do. I'll use my persona. The opponent is strong. Don't do anything reckless. Persona. My heart is a bird. I'll punish you. Hey, you're really strong right now. I'm so sorry, Jose. But we're gonna put you in the ring! Ah! Put him in the ring! Pardon me. <laughs> Let's do okay. this. Give that child the steel chair! You ready? Always! Poor Jose! job all around. Sorry about that. Is that how I feel now? Painfully well. <laughs> Thanks to all of you, I... Ooh, did you learn something new? I'm pretty sure I understand humans less than ever. Oh? Uh? I was anticipating he'd say the exact opposite. And reason the proletariat to send his child with a steel chair. Yeah, I was hoping things would end on a happy note here. Well, this is an issue. I'm sorry we couldn't help you. Why are you sorry? Well, he did say you understand humans even less now and all. That's great news. Huh? Humans aren't the easiest to comprehend. Yes. That's why they can get lost and look for other people they trust. Sometimes they even try to accomplish the impossible with those people. Huh? Like you all just tried to do for me. Huh. Now I'm sure that's what it means to be human. Jose, you are a good egg. So, it's impossible to learn everything about humans in such a short time. Although, it did make me realize just how much I love them. So our assistance was to your satisfaction. Guess she hates that. Yep. I finally understand now. I can go back to that person whenever I want. What person? Hey, Jose, who's this person you keep mentioning? Yaldablith. <laughs> and while we're at it, who are you? On asking the real questions. I have had this question for 240 hours of this game. <laughs> who's Jose talking about and who the fuck is he? Why? He's gonna reveal like it's Maruki or Yaldablith or something. My actual bet is I feel like it's Igor. Right? That's like the good ending. That's the good Jose ending. Bad Jose ending is like, it's Yaldablith. I I am me. I'm Jose, a boy who got a little smarter because I met all of you. Or adopted another child. No matter who we are, we're always searching for ourselves. Just remember, there are more folks observing humankind than you might realize. 
Ominous. 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 Cool. What do you mean? It's a secret for now. You'll find out someday. So, Persona 6? <gasps> okay. I have something for you. To thank you for spending so much time helping me. Here, take this. Star water tray. <laughs> this is so interesting. Oh, humans. No wonder the others just can't leave them be. The others? What fucking eldritch space gods are you talking about? Jose! Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Don't worry, it's nothing. See you guys. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, I hope you'll still help me collect flowers, too. Off I go. Good job. I don't fully understand what just happened, but did that take care of his problem? He's the highest move, too. Jose. He may be weird, but he sure is a cute little kid. I gotta hang out with Yogg so Sothith now. What? Lady On? I'm cute too! I have more questions now than I did previously! And the fact that you just find him here waiting for you. Come to think of it. Like... What the fuck does that mean? It is really- it, it, it's legitimately very, very interesting. Like... So like, okay. So let's 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 take a moment and think about Jose. Let, let's take the information that we know about Jose. We know Jose is powerful, right? We know Jose is powerful, and we also know Jose is not a Persona user. It can be safely assumed that Jose is not human at all, because of the way he talks about humans. Hmm. So we know Jose is not human. We know Jose's powerful, but not a Persona user. And we know Jose's not, like, a demon. Well, presumably, he's not a shadow, right? He does have yellow eyes, but his yellow eyes are similar to Lavenza's and the Twins and the Velvet Desidents. In fact, I would argue he is the most similar to them, which is what makes, makes me believe that he's, like, one of Igor's. Right? That's that's my belief with Jose. So there's a couple of other interesting clues in regards to Jose as well. One of them being Jose's affiliation with stars. Stars are a big thing with Jose. The stamps are stars. His menu has stars. He has a star-based attack. The stamps change from stars to moons. He's got a very celestial theme. A very stellar space-like theme. Is he an alien? I don't know about that. I don't know if that's necessarily true. Um, is that as off? I mean, right? He is likely something eldritch, potentially, though. Kind of like the Velvet Dissidents, like some kind of god. He probably is. Though, there is still yet another interesting thing with Jose. That's his appearance. He's got a cute little coat, but if you guys notice, his nose is like a thin tip and his hair is like 
looks like a Lego man's hair, right? And his ears are like holes. He's like a doll. When I first met Jose, I compared him to Pinocchio. He's like a mannequin. Right? Or like a robot. He's sort of this like... Yeah, he, he's, he's like a doll. And I think that might be part of it too. He's very doll-like, very puppet-like. And Kixie, that's actually a really good point. Instead of replacing uh, Igor's uh, Japanese VA, they're just going to have Jose take the role over. I could see that. Because he's like this boy that was made, right? And I could see after all this shit went down with Yaldableth, I could see Igor being like, I need to like retire or like do something different, right? But I have crafted my perfect replacement and that replacement has been spending all this time learning about the humans that he's going to eventually be helping. Because while Jose has sort of this ominous vibe to him, I don't think Jose's a bad guy. He totally could be, but just his whole demeanor and his behavior just doesn't seem to have any malice in it whatsoever. And not in like the accidental lack of malice kind of way that like, uh, you know, Maruki exists in. But like, um, but it's in this very genuine childlike fascination with humanity, right? I could see the future having a like Jose type of like, you know, Igor in like in kind of a position like that, or him becoming a velvet attendant. Or something like that, right? Um, except I'd still argue him taking over him being a velvet attendant is less likely. Because he's so different than, like, Lavenza and the Twits. The other two Velvet Attendants, while children like him, um, or seemingly look like children, again, I don't, th I feel like Lavenza's not a child. I feel like she's an adult. She's just small. Um, he, again, is like a mannequin. He's like a doll. He's not like a person. Seemingly, they are like people. Lavenza takes the form of a butterfly sometimes. But, like, they are sort of these de deific like people. Right? Um, so, like, I don't know. I I feel like him... I feel like him taking over for Igor makes the most sense. Or he's, like, the secret bad guy in, like, Persona 6 or something, right? But, like, again, I just, I just can't... I can't see him being malevolent. I've been waiting for you. Please be aware that I'll go slightly rougher on them. Like, I just... I just can't. I just can't, you know? This is a worthwhile strengthening. You're saying there's parts of Igor's personality split? No, not necessarily. I'm saying Igor is literally making a replacement for himself. And that's Jose. Senate level 99. Look at that. And Lucifer. I'm so good Let us aim game. for greater heights. You're stopping? Yeah, the only character we know explicitly that was created by Igor is a cat. A sweet little egg doll boy seems entirely within scope. Agreed. It, it seems like it's entirely. You're stopping. The compendium, yes. It seems you entirely like something that like Igor would do. Is to basically make a son, to make a child, make a son, Pinocchio. In fact, I wonder. Let me let me look at this. Author of Pinocchio. Elise Picano. Carlo Collati. Mm. 
shut up. Pinocchio character names. Because Lavenz is a Frankenstein reference, right? Lavenz is a Frankenstein reference. I wonder if Jose, the name Jose, is a reference to a Pinocchio character, perhaps. But I can't think of one. I can't think of one, like, or an author name, right? Because, like, most of them are, like, it's, like, Pinocchio or, like, Pucho or, like, uh, I mean, like, Geppetto. I mean, it depends on, like, if we're, if we're using, like, Disney Pinocchio, right? But I'm, I'm thinking, like, the original, um, the original, like, story, right? Geppetto. Yeah. No, there's no Jose. Unless Jose is like the translation of one of the names, because because Persona likes to do that shit too. They'll use like different names like in different languages and stuff. But I, I don't. Oh, I forgot Ewan McGregor was in was in a frickin' uh, uh, Del Toro's Pinocchio, huh. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not seeing any version of Pinocchio that has a Jose. Geppetto is a nickname for Giuseppe, which is an Italian form of Joseph. Which is a stretch, but Geppetto is definitely a Pinocchio character, if that is correct. Hmm. Maybe. I, I just wanted to check that quick, because, like, that that's what, like, Jose gives me Pinocchio vibes, right? Like, he, he gives me real, like, really Pinocchio-y vibes. Um, also, hi, Amon. Persona 2. I need to play Persona 1 and Persona 2. There's apparently a lot of really interesting lore in those games that does keep kind of coming back. Um, and one of my one of my friends is like the number one Persona 2 fan. Huh. Hmm. Yeah. Um. So you're saying this works if. Jose wants to be a real boy. I mean, he wants to be, he wants to learn more about humans, right? Kind of makes sense. I was going to ask regarding this, what do you think the Velvet Room is? That's a good question. Like, I, I love the Velvet Room and I love all the mystery behind it. I think it's super interesting. But I feel like the Velvet Room is like a, like a literal another like dimension, like a cognitive cognitive dimension because we do see in mementos in the deepest depths of mementos the yaldablith realm right we see the prison and the velvet room is in it actually is actually like in it right we go through that door right um so it seems to be kind of a part of the collective unconscious it's kind of like the space between spaces i think the velvet room is probably definitely more hidden than say a palace or mementos but it is, like, still interwoven into that realm. So it's, yeah, it's sort of like a palace. But it's sort of like this cognitive realm that exists in, like, the space of, like, the real, the, like, the real world and the cognitive realm, blah, 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 right? And people are brought there when they're identified to basically be, you know, the trickster. Like, somebody who's, somebody who can, like, change fate and somebody who can, like, do something. Or somebody who just needs help, even, Right? And, um, like, you're brought there because, you know, um, well, yeah, I mean, in, in this case for, like, Akira, you're brought there because it helps you, like, he needed help, right? And also he was going to be this sort of champion of a sort of, like, justice and rebellion. I like how you're cooking well in the Velvet Room. Yeah, it's great. Um... 
Because it is very mysterious, but from what I know of other Persona games, it's also very unique to each person. Which makes sense that the Velvet Room is its own cognitive realm. Because then the human, the person's perception, and their cognition, then will shift the Velvet Room into their sort of cognition. In a way, a manner of speaking, making it their own palace. And a manner of speaking, the Velvet Room is Joker's palace. And then for the other main characters in other Persona games, the Velvet Room is also their palace. That's why they're all different. It's because they reflect their cognitions of themselves and of their lives. They are the pal- the space is their palace, and they are kind of the ruler of the palace. Weirdly enough, too, there's precedent for this, because I know you're gonna say, oh, but a Persona wielder can't possibly have a palace. No. There's precedent for this, and it's Maruki. Maruki. He's the precedent. He has a persona. He has a palace. Oh, but that's just because he's, like, messing with cognition on such a grand scale. Are we not doing the same thing? We're not necessarily sweeping up entire parts of the world and changing people's minds and brainwashing them. But we have an immense amount of power. We're going all over the place. We're using our power for good. But we're still very strong, aren't we? The strongest, even. Right? I think that's what it is. Like, I, I think that's... I think it makes a lot of sense, if you ask me. Undergo mitosis. Nice. Mm -hmm. That's where the Phantom Thieves win after y'all they erase them. Palace. Right? Safety. Cognition. I remember saying this, but I have some lore ideas about that contradiction. Really interesting. To the cognition of the one person who remembered them. Yep. It's a daisy chain, right? And they were captured within the palace like, or the Velvet Room, like a palace, and, I mean, kept safe. Because while Maruki's used his uh, world-altering cognition and persona for evil, we used it for good. We used it to save our friends, right? That also explains, again, why Yaldablith, when it was revealed that he was Igor, Led instead of trying to fight us in the Velvet Room, because if we're the palace ruler, he has no power here! And that's why he relied upon the twins to do it as well, because they are sort of part of this cognition, right? They're part of the palace. They're shadows or cognitions of the palace. Not really, they're kind of unique in that regard, but they kind of take on, again, the form that we need. Also might explain why the twins are especially initially chi childlike. Um... Because it represents sort of a destruction of innocence that Joker went through. And that's why Lavenza, even though she's still kind of childlike or kind of innocent, she's also much more mature, adult, and like steadfast. Because it's an evolution of Joker as well. Hmm. I don't know. I could be wrong. I think it's, I think it's good thought, though. Viewing the compendium? Good talk and discussion. Hell yeah. Please be 
aware that there is an alarm. Be prepared for fusing several at once. Please be more careful than usual. Is this okay? I hate that fucking thing. You're stopping? How was the alarm? I'm sure you'll love learning more about this in each and every Persona game. Oh, oh for sure. That's why it's important bitches don't try to spoil me on shit. I intend on playing them. But if you spoil things in an effort to sound intelligent or smart, um, well... Dick move. I should write something. Anyway. That was our, uh, finale for Mementos, it looks like. I guess we're done. And I don't think we're coming back. What do you want to do? I have a lot of flowers. So long, Lamentos. Not really anything I want from them, so. Yeah, I know there's demons. Dad aren't gonna get divorced anymore. Sound happy, man. Come and talk about talking things out. Have a little family trip play next weekend. Good news. I glad we made a difference. Got a dad you could trust. One who really feels like a family. Gotta feel great. Oh, Yuji. Hmm. Did you know that Cody or Joker is based off the wild card of deck of cards? No. I never would. But. That was so far gone, man. I watch our stuff around idols. Sad boy Ryuji. And Mask deleted his whole video archive. But he's been putting up apology bids in their place. Well, yeah. oh, there's to help his feel little, his little brother feel better, too. Another the post on the fan site, too. I heard their apology to my family. He sounded happy. Wonderful. I'm glad everything turned, uh, turned out all right in the end. Hey! Little known fact, but the entire Persona franchise is actually a spin-off of the Shin Megami Tensei series. Hopefully that's not a spoiler. <laughs> Whoa! It is? Real talk though, I love that SMT fans are so fucking better that Persona's more popular than their game series. Have you guys noticed that? I have. <laughs> I've seen that a lot actually. There's a lot of very bitter Bettys about it. <clears throat> For real? For real? Give everyone a proper apology, that's great. Sounds better, but now it's up to for him to make things right. Yo. Cool box. Hey! Oh! What? SMT groups are an achievement amongst themselves. <laughs> well, does it feel good, Master? Oh, see you later. Kawakami man boundaries. I have a girlfriend. Um, you'll tell me SMT is cooler if you're a huge religion nerd, but I'm not, so I can't judge. Like, you know, the funny thing is, the funny thing is, I'd probably like SMT. Like, I probably really would. Um. The main thing that keeps me away from it, though, is one, I have more Persona games to play. I'll be doing that first. Two, the mechanics of the game. <laughs> the demon negotiation and, like, fusion and shit and, like, the Pokemon collect-a-thon. I do not like that shit. I hate that shit. I am not a Pokemon girl. What do you want and to even do? still, the times I have played Pokemon, Poke let's face it, Pokemon's a pretty simple game. Yep. It's not very complicated. Make sure you close up. Hi. Um, like, an SMT's definitely a more complex version of that. And also has like the demon negotiation mixed in and just like other shit and like, yo, nothing sounds less fun. 
I'm sure it's probably done better in those games. Hello. But like... I said like if every single Pokemon was like the fucking Reggie Trio from RSE, I'd... Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald? See, that doesn't make that doesn't mean anything to me because again, I'm not a Pokemon girl. I don't know what that means. Anyway, I was pushing glasses over there. Actually, let me tell you about effort values of power training. After years and years of SMT, negotiations are a pain roulette. <laughs> Shit. Like, I'm not gonna lie, you know, and I'm sure, I'm sure plenty of SMT's fans know this, they just don't want to admit it, but like, there's a reason the more approachable game series is more popular. Sorry, that's why Persona's more popular. It's, it's easier, it's, it's more approachable, it's, uh, it plays better. And again, like, maybe I could be like super, super duper 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 wrong, but like, not everyone's gonna get into the thick of, like, the Gnosticism and, like, religious, like, mythological references and, like, the lore plot of it all and want to, like, bang out hours and look up guides and, like, do negotiations, like, and all that jazz, right? Um, but people are just gonna simply not want to do that. That's, that's gonna, gonna be how it happens. Is for B6 to be one of the party members to have a Mara? No. No, never let that happen. And for Sammy, and then grain themselves in the heart of Sammy. No, 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 I refuse. I hope that never happens. Welcome. Or you deny the throbbing kick of desire, Sammy. Cause I don't like him! <laughs> I don't like the throbbing king of desire. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. <laughs> I see. I see. What do you want to do? More stamina. Hey. Have we invited? I don't think we've done you scare on yet, have we? I know we did Morgana and Ryuji <sighs> and Bokoto, Taba and Haru and Akechi. Yeah, let's do a uh, let's do one. Oh. Hmm. Hey, thanks for coming in. I have seven million yen. Holy shit. Awesome. Is this what it looks like in here? Like a hideout for adults. Grim's pretty neat too, but this isn't bad either. That on's so pretty. Love that for her. This drink. It's flavor. I think I like it. It's kind of got a mature vibe to it. Hey. When I practice my walk for my modeling job, sometimes I feel like I forget how to walk normally after. I don't smile looks stylish walking that way, but if a high schooler does it, I think it just looks like they're trying to show off. I'm going to show you how to do it sometime. Actually, it might suit you. On, I love you. God, she's so, she's such a goober. I think Kira's like, yeah, I want a model lock. You think it impressed Makoto? That was fun, huh? Oh, hmm. We talked a ton. It's kind of nice to just chat in a place like this. I gotta take a good look at myself by talking with you. Thanks for inviting me. All right. On got swole. Seriously? 
kitchen choker one runway moves. Hi. Love her. Love her. Joker does the JoJo pose. Alright, see you later. Hey, hey. Well. Well, well. Well. Well, well. Beef Wellington. Is it every confidant is available today? I think it kind of is. Three afternoons. God, what's that like? We all know what I'm going to do, though. Gonna check out my plants. Our vegetables. See. <laughs> I did save scum it. I did save scum the date. So I'm gonna do a date with her, and I'm gonna See. give her that damn motorcycle statue, cause I still have it. you to die at with a catchy this stream. Oh, you did some amendments requests and the catchy was in the active party. Yes. I have something. That's great. But yeah. I should write We're something. gonna funkin' do this. Makoto! Hello. No! We'll get him next time. Uh, well, you can clip it if you like. Yeah, just get her out. So all you need to do is wait till the day of the heist. So I am today's plan. Hang out. I see. It was important to be ready, but I we need to take breaks now and then. Um, it's all right. Be together. I have a special bond with Makoto. Let's do this. What will you do? What do all these options mean? I kind of wonder. Like, let's go somewhere fun is probably taking her... Um... Taking her someplace, right? Let's broaden our views. I feel like that's the same thing. So, I don't know what that means. I know what let's go to my room means. It means banging. Means banging. Okay, so they just go to like they just go we just go to some place. Huh, interesting.
Beats consensual hand holding in the attic. True. Bottom is usually just like, let's just chat. Okay. That's why we saved, baby. Take Makoto to see the fishes. I might take her to the aquarium, actually. I feel like Makoto would like the aquarium. Uh, well, I see. <clears throat> Great. What will you do? Go somewhere yes. fun. You want to go? The place somewhere stimulating would be nice. Plus, I've never been to before. Likes ramen though. Ferris wheel would be cute. I took her to there though. We we went there, right? Oh, can I not go to the? I can't go there. I can't go to the aquarium. So, intimate date spot. So we could go to the intimate date spot. Yeah, I can't, I can't go to the aquarium. That's kind of, she's closed today. Gar. Okay. I've been, I've been there, but we've, we've never been over here. So let's go, let's go to the Ferris wheel. All right. Is Ferris wheel there, wanna go? Yeah, let's go. I think I've ever ridden a Ferris wheel. I'm a bit nervous. And she gets all blushy. Then, oh, shall we go? Uh, um. Oh, this is gonna be cute. Go on a date right next to the palace. Hell yeah, dude. Is thing really safe? Well, why would you lean too far if we both sit on the same side? Uh, actually, I, I can hear this terrible creaking too. I'm very sorry. <laughs> Them and their matching coats. I know. I love that they both have the same coat. I know it's like they're wearing the student outfit, but it's just—it's so cute. Someone's scared of heights. Mm -hmm. The coat is afraid of heights. Goober. Sorry, I'm not used to things like this. I was supposed to be your senpai, too. Mm -mm. Hey, Akira, what do you do when you're nervous like this? Or, or um, should I, should I not be asking about things like that? Riz! 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 The Riz button! <laughs> God, that's so smooth though. That she's all like nervous about it. Just be like, like all right, like A B B. Riz. I'm close. Uh, um. I, I I can't I can't look at your face. I'm too embarrassed. <laughs> God, I love Makoto so much. She's such a goober. <laughs> She's so crit. <laughs> How did she <laughs> looks? Huh. <laughs> ah, make sure. Because I'm the one getting. I'm the only one getting flustered here. <laughs> Love you just makes me seem so foolish sometimes. I love Makoto. I love her so much. 
Oh my god. I have a special bubble. Oh, right. I guess someone's a coat of my leg. She delighted to read something relevant to her. She just like. Alright. There you go, Makoto. How do you know? I've wanted this ever since I first saw it. It's so little, but you can still buy separately sold parts to customize it however Thank you, you want. Thank you very much. This is so amazing. Thank you, Akira. Riz. Feels like I really captured Makoto's heart. Um. One round is so short. I love Makoto. God. This is a Makoto stand stream. I need everyone to be very aware of that. Now, Akira getting that switch at the top of the Ferris wheel. Oh, you know, oh, you know it. After rizzing her up and then, like, giving her the motorbike, the motorbike figurine. Ah, yeah. Hey! Yep. Make sure you close up. Hi! Oh, my God. Also, I got three days left. Do I need to, like, send the calling card tomorrow, then? Is that how that works? I'm on fire. <laughs> really? I love Makoto. She always has my back emotionally and my backside physically when the mood strikes. <laughs> Real. Okay, no, the third is the, the the third is the actual card deadline. Right. Oh huh. That's not very helpful. No. Not really. Yusuke yet, so we'll invite Yusuke. Oh. And there we go. Hmm. That's the last one. We've done all of them once. Hey. Thanks for coming in. There, I took everyone to the jazz club once. Uh huh. Why are you oh. hunched over, Yusuke? This place looks interesting. I thought we were entering a catacomb, but. It's not bad at all. Oh, I feel it. I feel inspiration flowing in me. <laughs> I'm not going to be sleeping tonight. Just came what the fuck, dude? <laughs> He's so weird. I love him. This drink. Delicious. The portions are mixed perfectly. <laughs> I should have known. I search for models. Even when I ask a woman who catches my eye, I find that their souls do not match the same beauty. I have mistakenly thought I was hitting on them. It's quite a struggle to clear up that misunderstanding. But the most complicated situations arise when they ask to be friends. I have no, sp I have no time to spare on anything besides art. <laughs> Yusuke with the autistic Riz. And then having to be like, no, no, I don't, I don't have time to be your, no, I don't have time for a relationship. Love that for him. Poor guy. I enjoyed that. All right. Turn to the left. Okay, nice. Thank you. So effortlessly funny. Oh, for sure. I'm at home. This is an evening well spent. See you later. I love Yusuke. What a guy. What a champion. Hi! I can't 
can't believe we're getting to the end here. Good morning. Oh, hello there. Good morning, Akira. <laughs> Days until the deadline. I feel it's going to be up soon as well. What did you after that? Sip. I'm not obligated to tell you. That's not a part of our deal. Never mind the future. Just focus on defeating Maruki for now. If we lose, a fate more humiliating than death will be waiting for us. Akashi's just like, Welp, I'm gonna go rogue after this and you can't stop me. I'm like, alright. <laughs> like, okay, Akashi. Sure. I'm going to go watch Barbie. Sounds like something he'd do. Well, well, well! Is that another day Makoto's available? <laughs> I mean, this really shouldn't be a surprise to anybody, right? Today is every confidant day. God, yeah, pretty much. This is my last day of free time? Let's do it. So I should do Lavenza tonight, then. Is that true? Technically. That's great. You know, what's the point of having a deadline if it's not the actual deadline? All right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Like. All right, fair. Oh, thank you for the heads up. Then I'm obviously gonna hang out with Makoto and then I'll hang out with Lavenza tonight. I was gonna maybe do Lavenza tomorrow, like the next day's night, but apparently it's a bad idea. Uh, well. I thought I put February 2nd as the calling card deadline. Well, apparently not. Let's hang out. I see. It's always important to be ready, but maybe it's not enough. Sumi Third Awakening, I believe, is automatic, isn't it? That's kind of what I was told. worrying about it let's do this what will you do do we go to a do we do we consensually hold hands or do we like go someplace because there's a couple places I wa I wasn't able to go to her with I wanted to go to the aquarium, but wouldn't let us do that. Oh, let's yes. see if the fishes are available, maybe. Oh, it still won't let us go there. Well, that sucks. Oh, that might be because it's winter, yeah. Kinda silly. Cause like the beach makes sense, right? But like... Show her the stars? 
Oh yeah, there's a there's an observatory. Except I don't think I can go to that either. Isn't it that one? Atlas being homophobic for not allowing aquarium dates. Real. Does it? I. It won't let me info dump to Makoto about the shark. Yeah, that's. There's the observatory. I don't know why. I wonder if it's because it's a night's date spot or something. Alice uh, said Yuri is forbidden. <laughs> also, high rose. No, whatever it's like, oh, it's available at night kind of thing. But I took her to Harajuku, I think, for our first date. She apparently does like ramen. I don't think I've ever taken her there. I think we maybe did do the mon monjayaki before. And I believe I took her there, too. So I think the ramen place is the only place we haven't gone to. And she said she liked ramen, so like... Oh, we're gonna remind you if you've been there. Let, uh, let me check it. Right, yes. Okay. No. Yeah. I think. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Yep. Yeah. So, indulge the GF. Food it is! Get the GF some snacks. Oh, I haven't been to a ramen shop in a long time. Then... It would be nice to go again. Can I ask that you show me where it is? Hmm. Look at that line. Would it really be that good? It's hard to tell just from looking at the place. It does smell great, though. Um, should we get a line? I had ramen it's delicious before. I even ended up drinking the broth. But to be honest, last time I was in one of these shops was back with my father. Oh, Makoto, don't be sad. It's a little difficult going to one of these places alone, don't you? Riz button! <laughs> You're not alone now. Thank you very much. Thanks. I wonder if being with you will help me uh, break out of my shell. Either way, I'm going to keep trying. I hope you'll be there to assist me. <laughs> He's so reassuring. Joker is just the best guy. He is just the nicest boy. He's just the bestest boy. Like seriously, dude. actually get addicted to this ramen. Maybe get an extra large bowl next time. Don't kick me out if I take too long, right? Shall we return home? Oh, there's still a line outside. Shall we head home? I have a special bomb with Makoto. Alright, so there's Makoto my life. She might like a heart ring, right? Give her a ring. Like, that'd be kind of cute. She'd probably like that. It'd captivate a woman's heart. She is a woman with a heart. She does have a heart. That is true. A watch. Maybe you give her something to wear. No, that's true. That's true. She didn't. She did. It is. What? Oh, wasn't this expensive? Are you sure you want me to have it? Thank you very much. This is great. I'll be sure to cherish this. Thank you, Akira. I love. I love the Makoto's first reaction. Just. This is expensive. You want me to have this? 
<laughs> and it's like, yeah. Oh, benefactor. Uh, my stomach feels somewhat heavy. Can we take the longer route home today? <laughs> Makoto's like, uh, sodium. <laughs> It's already February. We got only three days till the deadline. Oh crap, what do we do? Called it. Calm down, I understand it's a tense situation. Something would happen, it'd be tomorrow, correct? Oh, here's the warning. It hasn't sprung any surprises on you, has he, Akira? Nothing. So that's all we can do is wait. Akira likes keeping us in suspense, huh? Whatever Dr. Murky decides, I don't think we're getting out of this without a fight. We need to be prepared for anything. You're right. We already beat up a god, right? We can take him. Yep. Anything you still need to do? Alright, yep. Okay, so that's the warning. <gasps> Corazin! Hey, hey! Oh, it's Dionysus. Yeah. I don't know how to spell that. How do you how do you spell Dionysus' name? Joyful celebration. Uh I feel like Like Dionysus. Can't be a holiday. Festival would make sense, but there's no L. Birthday party. various countries amassing numerous cults of fanatic worshippers. Yet it's decided two centuries ago the ancient Greek culture, Apolloian Dionysi, literary work, the birth of tragedy. Festivity. All right. I see. Nice. Dub. Oh well. Alright, it's time for the final hangout. Y'all ready? Let's do it. Oh, 
Oh, this is gonna make me sad. Oh. I was splendid with you, spending time with you, living all sorts of fun stuff together. Though I've been wondering, show me your current home. I'd like to see this room that has shaped you as a person. <sighs> I do understand my timing is not the most appropriate, given the state of the world, but... Here, let's go. Certain? Thank you. Thank you so much. Let us be off immediately. This is a storage room, yes? But where is your room? Oh, Lavenza. <laughs> I'm looking at it. Oh, I would never have guessed. She's like, oh, you live like this? <laughs> So you prefer cramped, dingy spaces. How fascinating. <laughs> Lavenza, please! I'm sorry! Please, tell me more about yourself. Oh, I'm sensing some unusual energy around this desk. Oh. Roasted by a child. That's just a dumpster in your room, apparently. Your infiltration tools are made here? Could I possibly try my hand at it? Lamenta, do you want to make a lock pick? Sure. No problem. Thank you. Let us see what I can do. Now, what should I make? No, to show my gratitude for rescuing me, I shall craft for you a secret weapon. Teaching a child to cry. What a good big brother joker is. I think you'll be rather pleased with it. Hmm. This is trickier than I expected. Oh. Uh-oh. Well, I can fix that. Lavenza? Ouch! Cursed screwdriver, how dare you defy your wielder! I love Lavenza, God! Cursed screwdriver, she like pokes herself. These hangouts are so good. I love just the interactions that you have with the Velvet Desidents like this. It's so fun. Obey me! Drive those screws! Ugh. Oh, she's working on top of the laptop, yeah? Oh, screw it! <laughs> oh, screw it! Megido! Oh, Lavenza! Uh... It seems my time out of body has led to my becoming somewhat undexterous. That was the Carolina. In, there was the Caroline in her. Just the like, just oh screw it, make it look like just about to cast a fucking nuclear bomb. God. You can you can really see how the the two personalities like poke out in her. Out of body time has led me to become somewhat undexterous. While it pains me to say it, your secret weapon will have to wait. So sorry, Lorenzo. More importantly, I should be using this time to learn more about you. Is this your bed? Yes, Lorenzo. It's surprisingly similar to the one in your cell. Can you truly rest here? <laughs> She's like... <laughs> She's not letting this man breathe! Like, fun stuff has happened in it. I've had sex in that bed. Whoa! It as much as you like whenever you rest. I must say I am a bit jealous. True. St 
Still, this space seems somewhat cramped for a fully grown human and a feline. May I sit? Optimum firmness, ideal warmth. Well, that's what they call me in college. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm not sure why, but I feel so calm here. <sighs> oh, is she getting eepy? The vents are eepers. <sighs> She's so eepy. <laughs> up to this sledgehammer. <laughs> so cute! <laughs> Dream Lavenza fucking whacking him with a sledgehammer. God. Lavenza from the top with a sledgehammer. Uh, she's in a dream. There's the Caroline we know. Real. God. I love Lavenza. She's so cute. Take that. Huh? It didn't work? Seems like she's fighting someone in her dream. Oh, wait. You can't. Uh, no. I'm being split again. Oh, hey, girl. Oh, God. <laughs> she... Can... Wait, can Velvet... Wait, hold up. That means Velvet Desidens can dream. And also, like, have PTSD. a little too much. You're probably a little high strung there, Lavenza. I sense some residual energy here as well. Ah, you use it for training. May I ask for a demonstration? Come on! One, two! One, two! Put your back into it! You think you can save the world like that? That sound like Caroline again. <laughs> one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Don't expect me to go easy on you. I'm doing this for your sake. God. Poor Polyps inmate. Well done. Such commendable willpower. Oh my God. I can sense some lingering energy around this television. Or is it actually coming from the box attached to it? The gamer. What is this? Wanna try that? 
I've only heard of them in stories, but is this one of your world's vaunted video games? They say that once a player begins, they're unable to tear themselves away. Oh, she's gonna become a gamer! If it truly can entrance humans to such a degree, could you play a bit for me? I see. You're piloting the spaceship, and your objective is to destroy the oncoming enemies. Let's get into our gamer arc. Girl, where'd you put the grimoire? Look how they scatter. This is quite impressive. You weave around each bullet with dizzying precision. Whoa, there's so many of them now. Oh, you're surrounded. Look out, on your right. I mean left. No, they're in front now. Use the boost. Backseat gamer. Look, it's the boss. Fire the beam cannons. Annihilate it. You did it! The world is saved! She's so fucking cute. <clears throat> A most dexterous display. <laughs> just, just a... <clears throat> I can certainly see why humans get so passionate about these games. Perhaps I'll ask my master if we can install one in our room. <laughs> she comes back, <laughs> like, Can we get video games? <laughs> and Igor's like, What? Please, I want to play video game. I feel like Igor would say yes. I feel I feel like he I, I feel like he would. You know, better yet, I feel like Igor. Yeah, I feel like Igor would play Mario Kart with her. I feel like he would. I've enjoyed this first-hand glimpse into your daily life. It was quite illuminating. Before I became whole, I visited many places with you and gained a wealth of new experiences. Thanks to that, I feel like I've come to understand humans better. And this calls back to the Jose thing too. And perhaps more importantly, I feel like I understand you better. So, thank you. That is so cute. Though you have cast off your shackles, I will still await you in that room. This is a token of my gratitude for today. Please take it. Burn soul. That's it. it would be a shame if I were to leave so soon. May I stay a little longer? Like, I do very much like. Ah, hi. Oh, hi. Right. Whatever. Yeah. Bigger might take umbrage with the constant play of video games. I feel like that was a whole thing. Ah, it's fine. Um. I was going to say those. I I really love our relationship with Lavenza. I love the Caroline. Justine, Lavenza. I love, I love that whole dynamic. I think it is very, very good. And I do think, like, it's very fun and cool how we just have this, like, little goblin in our corner the whole time, right? Um, and she's, like, fun and interesting and interested in us, but in this very, like, curious and, like, educational kind of sense, but also, like, very supportive of us. Like, yeah, Little Buzz is a real one. Yeah, she's got her back. Like, I loved the twins. I love the twins so much. Lavenza is, I feel like, a worthy successor to them. So I do I do feel like they did a great job with her. Um, and it helps that she really does feel like a combination of both of them, right? That that's good. That works, right? That that works, and that's fine. Um I just I just love that she's just so cool. Like, I I love this very, like platonic, supportive, educational, like, relationship that we have with her. It's proof that we could do that with more characters, too, and they don't have to be romance options, looking at you. Lots of other 
freaking characters. Well, Vents are just the twins, but warm instead of cold, pretty much. There's like a happier version of them. Yeah, so that makes sense. Yep, I really like her. She's great. <clears throat> Good morning, uh, Akira Senpai. Uh, so today is the day Dr. Maruki is supposed to contact us. Um. No. Oh, I'm fine. I've just had something in my mind. I need to think about it a little more for now. We should just get to school. It's coming oldie today. I'm so nervous. And her picture changed. Damn, I can't focus on class at all. How's that any different from usual? I, I'm gonna be honest, I fucking hate that her appearance changed back. I fucking hate, I, I legitimately revile that. I hate it so goddamn much. I don't want to rant about it because I have talked so much about her, but like, I hate it. I really, really hate it for a lot of reasons. Not just from the character design or what. I just, I just, I just, I just hate it. usual? Shut up. Seriously can't take today. I even tried. Well, I don't like always. You know it. You've been so blessed with your cool composure. Oh, I love the character. And I also hate this. Yeah, see, I, I feel like everyone does. Yeah. Thank you, Zoe. I care, you're the one my rookie is most likely to approach. If that happens, just make sure you handle it as we just as we play. This is a cure here. We ain't got nothing to worry about. That was a lot to bear, but. Can we ask you to make the call for us, uh, for us if he does show his face? I gotcha. Let us know right away if anything goes in this, okay? It's <sighs> move gonna be. Now I'm starting to get a little antsy here. Hi, Puccini. What do you want? God. Um, Senpai? Dr. Moore? Be contact. Yep, mentioned several times. What happens? There's something I want to tell you. Is there any time today? Oh, okay. Seems like she wanted to talk to you earlier this morning, too, so maybe you should hear out. Um, respond later. Okay, so this is probably her awakening that then. Snow? That, that makes sense. Just in time for last die. La the last, the last of the days. Um, yeah. I'm happy Sumi has become an actual character, but I miss you screaming in fear whenever she appears. Yeah, that was a funny running gag. I did like that, but especially now, it just doesn't feel like appropriate to do. Um, the only time you can get this scene. Okay, yeah, so I, I see what you mean by it locks you in. Yep, that makes a lot of sense. Because I'm sure, like, tonight, he's gonna be all like, ooh, tentacles. You know, um, it was a good bit. I liked it, but it doesn't feel appropriate to do now. And especially just like, I'm just exhausted when I see her now. Uh, though I do think I could try to get her awakening here. That wouldn't necessarily be a bad move, but I feel like I'm gonna launch immediately in to the Maruki stuff. He's gonna ooga booga you. I mean, that's what I mean. I think he's gonna ooga booga me. So, like, I feel like I should maybe stop here. Like, I feel like we've d we've accomplished what we wanted to accomplish, right? We wanted to get through mementos. We wanted to get all cut up till we go into the palace, right? And this this kind of feels like, um, excuse me. This kind of feels like the place where we stop before we get on the train. Because I feel like the cutscene, like we're gonna get locked into a cutscene right after we're done talking to Sumi. That's my, like that's my thought. And then the next stream, we can just kind of do it all in one go, right? Just kind of go through the whole thing. 
feel like that makes the most sense. Do her? Alright, <laughs> well now. We'll have the last chance to save after this. Like, am I gonna get locked into a cutscene right away? Because, like, how long is that cutscene gonna be? Like... I think it makes sense to stop here. You know, we'll just stop here. Let's do it. Realistically, I don't think it's gonna take that much time. I knew I was probably gonna have to end early anyway, just because I wasn't gonna be able to do everything. Like I wasn't gonna be able to like tackle the whole thing, right? So I think this is probably good. It's a sh shorter stream, but probably for the best. I think it'll feel a lot better to just try to tackle this thing in one fell swoop. Um, especially because of, like, we did that for the Yaldablith thing, where we stopped right before we got to the Holy Grail, and I'm really glad I- I'm really glad I did that. Because the ensuing next part was, like, a seven-hour thing. So I'm really glad. It'll hit harder too. Yeah, it will. We'll kind of we'll kind of get in the train of it, you know. Um, so I kind of knew today was gonna be short just because of like the circumstances, right? Um, but that's fine. I think um, I think that's okay, right? W that just means we're kind of primed for the uh, we're kind of just primed for like the uh the next go, next go of it, you know. Um. We will be doing that on Monday. I have a doctor's appointment and like a car appointment on Monday, but those are in the morning. So hopefully I won't be late to stream or anything. I hope. Um, but uh, yeah. So that's what's going on. Um, I love you all very, very much. Uh, thank you all for being here. Like I said, uh, we're gonna tackle that stuff for we're gonna tackle that stuff for Monday. Again, I think it's just gonna feel better to do in one big swoop. Like, we're just one, like, block. Um, hope that doesn't upset anyone too much. Mm -mm. So, hope you feel better. I hope I feel better too. This sucks. This has been a bad week. <laughs> um, so hopefully, hopefully next week is better. Uh, we're gonna go raid Moody. Those are my socials. I'll be posting my stream schedule next week. I don't know what we're gonna- I mean, we might just start Persona 4 next week, too. So. Boop. Uh, we'll finish up Persona 5, maybe start Persona 4. Um, we have Baldur's Gate 3 on the horizon as well. Um, I might budget in some FF14 streams here, too. Uh, assuming people are still interested. Uh, because I know they added another dungeon had an idea for something else but i love you guys so much we're gonna go right moody go say hi to her give her a no booga booga um and yeah that's all i got i will see you guys at monday on monday at about four four ish so see you there for the end see how it goes bye, -bye. say hi to moody love you guys <laughs>